Hello and welcome to Medical Dialogues. I'm Anshika Mishra. Let's look at today's top medical news. Study reveals risk factors for long COVID. Early in the pandemic, many people who had SARS-CoV-2 infection or COVID-19 began to repeat that they couldn't get rid of their symptom even after a month or more unusually long for a viral infection of upper respiratory tract or develop new persistent symptoms soon after the infection cleared. Although it's still not clear what causes post-COVID-19 conditions or long COVID, a new study by researchers at Columbia University published in JAMA Network Open confirmed the high burden of long COVID and sheds light on who's at the greatest risk. The study involved over 4,700 participants from the collaborative cohort of cohorts for COVID-19 research who were asked to report their time of recovery after infection with SARS-CoV-2. The study found that between 2020 and early 2023, the median recovery time after SARS-CoV-2 infection was 20 days and more than 1 in 5 adults did not recover within 3 months. Are you also aspiring to excel in medical journalism and delve into the intricacies of health and medical reporting? Explore our comprehensive course on medical and health journalism available at the Medical Dialogues Academy. Learn from industry experts who possess the depth knowledge and experience in this field. For further details, scan the QR code provided or access the link in the description box below. Women and adults with pre-pandemic cardiovascular disease were less likely to recover within three months. Other pre-pandemic health conditions including chronic kidney disease, diabetes, asthma, chronic lung disease, depressive symptoms and a history of smoking were linked to longer recovery times. But these associations were no longer significant after accounting for sex, cardiovascular disease, vaccination and variant exposure. The study also found that people with a milder infection including those who were vaccinated against SARS-CoV-2 and those who were infected with an Omicron variant were more likely to recover quickly. Recovery time was similar for subsequent infections. All the studies have suggested that many patients with long COVID experience mental health challenges but did not find that depressive symptoms prior to SARS-CoV-2 infection was a major risk factor for long COVID. A study clearly establishes that long COVID posed a substantial personal and societal burden. Cells also know. By identifying who was likely to have experienced a lengthy recovery, we have a better understanding of who should be involved in ongoing studies of how to lessen or prevent the long-term effects of SARS-CoV-2 infection, said the authors. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned to Medical Dialogues for more updates. Never miss a medical update from Medical Dialogues. Like, subscribe and press the bell icon.